హలో ఎవ్రీ వన్ వెల్కమ్ బ్యాక్ టు అవర్ ఛానల్ హై పైసెస్ వాటర్ సైన్ దిస్ ఈస్ ఫిబ్రవరి మంత్లీ రీడింగ్ అండ్ దిస్ ఈస్ జనరల్ మే ఆర్ మే నాట్ రెసినేట్ ఎవ్రీ వన్ సో టేక్ వాట్ రెసినేట్స్ అండ్ లివ్ ద రెస్ట్ అండ్ ఎచ్ కుడ్ బి వైస్ వర్స్ అ గైస్ సో ఫస్ట్ వీ విల్ సీ జనరల్ దెన్ వీ విల్ సీ లవ్ మెసేజెస్ పైసెస్ వాటర్ సైన్ సో వాట్ ఆర్ ద మెసేజెస్ ఫర్ పైసెస్ అండ్ వాట్స్ గోయింగ్ ఆన్ వాట్ ఆర్ ద మెసేజెస్ ఫర్ పైసెస్ అండ్ వాట్స్ గోయింగ్ ఆన్ మెసేజెస్ ఫర్ పైసెస్ అండర్ ద టెక్ పేజ్ ఆఫ్ పెంటికల్స్ వీల్ ఆఫ్ ఫోర్చ్యూన్ ద అంప్రర్ సెవెన్ ఆఫ్ వాంట్స్ అండ్ త్రీ ఆఫ్ వాంట్స్ సో పైసెస్ ఓవరాల్ దెర్ విల్ బి ఏ ఇంప్రూవ్మెంట్ ఇన్ యోర్ లైఫ్ డెఫినెట్లీ ఎక్స్పెషలీ ఇన్ యోర్ కెరియర్ దెర్ విల్ బి ఇంప్రూవ్మెంట్ అండ్ యూ ఆర్ గోయింగ్ ఆఫ్టర్ వాట్ యూ వాంట్ maybe you are going after your goal and you are playing both defensive and offensive you are in a defensive mode yes you are protecting yourself and you are taking your power back and you are learning how to control your emotions and how to take your power back definitely because you are in your emperor energy and change wheel of fortune so change is coming i am seeing it is a positive change for lots of you and you will start something new in your life in february month it could be a project or it could be something new maybe you will learn some new skill or you will put your thoughts into action in february maybe lots of you are getting lot of thoughts regarding something so you want to do that thing or you want to do this thing so you are in some confusion but some of you will put something into action in february so let's see your reading recent past nine of swords page of wands and knight of Pen king of pentacles sorry so in recent past uh you were emotionally unbalanced maybe you were overthinking about someone or something in recent past uh, maybe you are you were thinking about money or financial crisis or financial stability uh, but it is it was only the process it is only the circumstances uh, so nine of swords so don't worry uh, i think you came out of that energy i'm seeing here because page of wands with king of pentacles you came out of that energy then you did hard work then you achieved financial stability yeah or you were thinking about someone or something in recent past it was only the phase then present six of wands six of cups and nine of pentacles see after this nine of swords energy you came out of in recent past lots of if not definitely in present you are not in that energy anymore right now you are getting success for your hard work especially career wise at the same time you are getting abundance in your life financial stability uh, and you are now independent financially and emotionally at the same time you are thinking about your childhood memories or you are thinking about someone a lot in these recent times and you are getting recognition you are getting awards and rewards for your success wow enjoy your success and celebrate your success pisces because you deserve it then future knight of swords queen of cups and nine of wands so someone is rushing to communicate with you in future you will receive communication at the same time uh, you will go after your uh, next goal you already reached one goal then you put another goal and you will focus on that goal no one and nothing can stop you because you will on fire at the same time you are a very emotional person especially because the water sign so you always share love to people around you but it is also important to nurture yourself so this is the message for you pisces so give some time to yourself to nurture yourself and yes maybe you learn to say no from past lessons pisces so in future you will guard it up for some people for some situation and the person involved in this connection could be aries leo sagittarius pisces cancer scorpio or capricorn virgo taurus so pisces let's see some love messages love messages pisces Oh, three cards. Love messages of Pisces. What's going on, Pisces? In your love life. 
love messages of Pisces, water sign, what's going on. Okay, we will see the present. Whew. King of Cups with the world. You both complete each other. I think there is a completion of cycle and for some there will be a new cycle is going to be begin between you and your person. I think I'm getting everything is okay between you and your person. Maybe you both recently reconciled with each other and this person do love you. And it could be you also, you also love this person. And for some Pisces, you have options in love. So let's see what else for Pisces. And lots of you are in long distance relationship, living in different cities, states or countries. What is the blockage? Justice and Queen of Pentacles. I think balance. Maybe in recent past, there was no balance between you and your person. So balance was needed. Maybe one person investing a lot in this connection than the other person. That could be the issue. That could be the blockage. So when there will be equal give and take, there will be no issues. Yeah, blockage. But you there, there, there was mutual love and understanding between you and your person. Some of you are dealing with Libra, A sign. So let's see what is coming towards this connection. Two of pentacles with five of swords again. So see, no balance. One person is juggling. One person investing too much in this connection than the other person. Or one person doing so many things at a time. They have no time to maintain this relationship. Definitely backstabbing energy here. Five of swords. Cheating on you. Lying to you. Something. So I want to clarify. Decision making. Yeah. A lot of confusion. Definitely a lot of confusion. And stability issues between you and your person. Commitment issues. So one person is, is unsure about commitment or marriage. This is justice is also marriage card. So there, was, there is law between you and your person. But commitment or stability issues. So let's see your person actions towards you, Pisces. What action they are going to take? Too many. Two cards I am not taking. This person is unsure about you, Pisces. Yeah, this person is holding back. That's why this, I think the juggling person is your person. Maybe they are waiting for change. Maybe they are waiting for divine timing. Definitely divine timing is the key here. Wheel of fortune. They are waiting for something here. So some cold shouldering energy. So you feeling like rejected. You feeling like ghosted here. So some, you are receiving cold shouldering energy from them. So what else? Yeah, waiting game is going, but they want success in this relationship. But there is some waiting period is going between you and your person. Definitely your person is waiting for something or someone here. It is a waiting game is going right now. Divine timing is the key to be honest with you. Yeah, I am not seeing any proper action here from their side. Maybe uh, they ghosted you in recent past. That's why now they can't face you. Maybe fear due to fearing of rejection here. So let's see your feelings towards them. What you are expecting from them. Pisces. That's why some of you decided to cut off this person from your life. Just do something. See, you are stuck. How oh, I create the cards. You are stuck. And you are trying to take the control of your life. But I am seeing some coming. Maybe a new person is coming into your life. Pisces. Choose that person. Because this person is coming towards you with a lot of passion. And with past person, definitely I am seeing there was ending between you and your person. Yeah, there is an ending. Because seven of swords with death. After you let go of this person, there will be a new beginning. There will be stability is coming with the new person. What I am getting here. Definitely trust issues involved here or mind games. Definitely some of you are dealing with Scorpio. So if you have options, definitely choose wisely. I am getting negative vibes here. Yeah, see, again, nine of swords. This person will put you in this. If you let them in again in your life or if you not let going of this person, you will face this situation. Overthinking, anxiety and depression, then it's up to you, Pisces. So let's see what is the final outcome and advice for you, Pisces. Your person is in very confusion or they're playing mind games with you. This person is sneaky, really sneaky. 
see you have to take your power back then you will find stability within yourself and your and your life also if you let them in in your life there will be confusion there will be lot of drama yeah you will be in this situation pisces otherwise if you take your power back you will be like this queen you are the queen of your life you are the king of your life see then a new person will give this 10 of cups emotional fulfillment but this person the current person you have in your life is very very sneaky and it is a red flag for you so then it's up to you what to do yeah this person have passion but this person is one night stand because nights always in and out of your life again they will be put in this they always in and out of your life this person is toxic guys it is a straight message some of you are dealing with under pisces sorry guys so let's see some messages from your person and through the channel this is the high time you have to focus on yourself first focus on your career focus on yourself then everything will be okay first you have to learn how to emotionally becoming very very strong player see i'm feeling sad without you reunion is coming who oh, oh, some of you will accept their apology or will accept them again it's up to you so this is the reading for you guys hope it resonates to you please do share like and subscribe my channel and click the bell icon then you will get all my video notifications thank you so much for watching and supporting me thank you